guys, welcome back to Click Academics. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to solve this exponential equation. So we have x to the power of x to the power of 3 is equal to 36. Now I'm first going to take the power of 3 on both sides. So now we have x to the power of x to the power of 3 to the power of 3. And now this is equal to 36 to the power of 3. Now, 36, well, this is equal to 6 squared, right? So now we have x to the power of x to the power of 3 to the power of 3 is equal to 6 squared to the power of 3. Now, if we have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n. As, so as you can see here, 6 squared to the power of 3, this would equal 6 to the power of 2 times 3, which is 6 to the power of 6. And in this case, this would equal x to the power of 3x to the power of 3. Now, if we have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is also equal to a to the power of n to the power of m. So then x to the power of 3 to the power 3 times x to the power of 3, this would equal x to the power of 3 to the power of x to the power of 3. This is equal to 6 to the power of 6. Now, if we have something in the form a to the power of a is equal to b to the power of b, then this means that a is equal to b. So in this case, this means that x to the power of 3 is equal to 6. And now if I take the cube root on both sides, these two cancel out. Now I'm left with x is equal to the cube root of 6. So this is our answer. And this can also be written as 6 to the power of 1 thirds.